Biden's campaign for the Trump campaign could become dangerous if the Republican Party changes. President Joe Biden built on a 2020 White House pledge to beat Donald Trump like a drum. Biden is gearing up for his anticipated re-election campaign, and he claims he can do it again. But what if Trump wasn't the Republican candidate for next year? The Republican primary is just getting started but a general election with Biden and another Republican could look very different than one with Trump. Biden's consistently low approval ratings and polls show that many Americans, even the majority of Democrats, don't want him to seek a term that doesn't end until he's 86. I'm here. I think it will be harder for both Biden and Trump to fight new candidates than to face each other," said Julian Castro a former Obama administration housing director who challenged Biden in the 2020 Democratic primary. Told. For now, Trump remains a major figure within the Republican Party and wields tremendous influence over key voters. Still, with former United Nations Ambassador Nikki Haley announcing his candidacy, the spectrum of Republican presidential candidates is starting to widen. Polls show Republican voters are open to supporting anyone other than Trump. Beyond Haley, Governor of Florida. Ron DeSantis could be a major Trump replacement. Moderate challengers like former Maryland Governor Larry Hogan could soon emerge. Trump's Vice President Mike Pence and Secretary of State Mike Pompeo could run. South Carolina Senator Tim Scott is planning a visit to Iowa, fueling speculation about his political future. Both could offer younger alternatives to both Biden and 76-year-old Trump, promising a fresher approach for Washington. But so many decisions could split the anti-Trump vote and allow the former president to win a fragmented primary. Selena Vasquez, founder of the progressive group Texas Latina List, said Biden's re-election call was based on his experience, not just beating Trump again. My generation and those behind me have seen the danger and disaster of MAGA Republicans, Vasquez said. MAGA is an acronym for the 2016 Trump campaign slogan Make America Great Again and has since become a common synonym for Trump's policies and supporters. After the Democrats showed remarkable resilience in last fall's election, no major challenger has emerged to face Biden in the party's next primary. Democrats have also replaced Iowa with South Carolina to start the 2024 primary at Biden's request, and despite still high inflation, unemployment has fallen to his lowest level since 1969.